If you want to see cars going into ditches, watch YouTube. But if you want to hear about them, they drove our economy into a ditch. Listen to the president in speech after speech, rescuing the car he says the Republicans crashed. We put on our boots. It's muddy down there and dirty and dusty and bugs everywhere. We're down there pushing, pushing, uh, shoving it. The Secret Service may not let the president drive more than a few feet, but he's been driving home this metaphor for months. The Republicans are up there looking at us, sipping on their Slurpees. It's the big laugh line. Sipping on a Slurpee. <laughs> Fanning themselves. <laughs> sipping on a Slurpee. <laughs> Saying you're not pushing hard enough. And we in the media are sucking it up. President Obama is portraying a Slurpee as the official beverage of obstructionist Republican leaders. The folks at 7-Eleven who sell Slurpees say, we really appreciate President Obama giving the Slurpee free publicity, but they note the Slurpee is bipartisan. The next thing you know, the president changed gears by changing drinks. You'd see the Republicans standing there having a latte. Then comes the president's punchline about the Republicans. And then they got the nerve to ask for the keys back. No, you can't have the keys back. You don't know how to drive. Critics say it's President Obama who's digging a deeper ditch. I don't care if Bush drove you into the ditch, stop digging. They say he's driving his analogy into a ditch, that he's driving the country off a cliff. As in Thelma and Louise, Lately, the president has embellished his story by telling Republicans, We'll give you a ride if you want, but you gotta sit in the back seat. They gotta sit in back. We just showed that soundbite in a tease, Mike, and I've already gotten hundreds of emails about it. <laughs> Pushing some buttons out there. As for what's on the Republicans' menu, Slurpees, lattes, what's next? A campaign condiment, perhaps? Pardon me, would you have any gray poupon? But of course. Genimo CNN. New York.